quick wig review. So before we get started, if you have not already, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Well, comment after the video. But definitely make sure you subscribe to my channel. We are getting very close to 1K, 1,000 subscribers. The deadline is May. I mean, YouTube deadline is just my personal deadline. So definitely click that button. So today's wig is by Outre. She's definitely an older wig. But I've had my eye on her for some time. I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and get her. I have Coco and I have her in the color 2T30. So Coco comes with combs here on the front, a comb in the back, and adjustable straps. Coco is definitely some beach ready hair. And she is long as hell. Let me show you how long she is. I'm gonna give you a 360. Y'all see how long she is? She's really cute. I really like the wave pattern, but I really am so, so about the color. I almost feel like the color is blending in with my skin. I don't know. I really wish I got this in a number two or a one B. I think that's the only thing that's hindering me from liking this unit more. Cause the color is pretty. I just feel like it's meshing in with my skin. I definitely would say this wig is big head friendly, so you have, if you have a larger head, Coco will be right for you. As I put my fingers through it, it glides really nicely. For it to be a long unit, I'm not getting any tangling right now. But mind you, this is a synthetic unit, and especially because it's longer, expect it to tangle. What else do I like about this hair? I just think it's nice summer beach hair. My spring lookbook is either out right now or about to come out. So you'll definitely see Coco in there. And yeah, she's cute. She's really cute. I just wish I got her in a darker color. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think in the comments down below. This review is gonna be really short because I don't really have much else to say. The parting was good. I just used my Gatsby glue and put it down and added some pressed powder, my Maybelline Fit Me powder in the 360 color. I used my curling wand to flatten down the top. Oh, one more thing I forgot. The roots I darkened. It was definitely the 2T30, it was all throughout, but it just looked a little weird to me. So I added the dark roots with a Sharpie and I liked it a lot better that way. But yeah, girl, this is some stripper hair, okay? Look how long this joint is. Oh, <laughs> but yes, let me know what you think. If you like it, if you don't like it, if you think I'm tripping about the color, if you agree with me, y'all know I love when y'all talk to me, so definitely let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you subscribe. We're getting so close to a thousand subscribers. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. It's been about almost three months on YouTube. Y'all are awesome. So thanks for rocking with me, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. I've lost my guys and thought of